Wow, this is insanely complicated. 72 pieces to put together. So I have B, which is labeled by B. It lays with the holes toward me. And A, labeled with an A, lays like this, where the two holes are here and here. Alright, now let the guessing game begin. I have these little L brackets, three of them, and I have 12 screws to attach A with F. F being this piece that has these little dimples on it. On the back there's some pilot holes, and on here there's some pilot holes. So let's attach the pieces together. And I'll do the same thing on A and B. I have the first piece assembled. This is the piece that was in question, but this is labeled as F and it has the dimples on it. And there's a ridge that goes along this. And you have these little L brackets that have pegs on the back that go in this ridge. And you have these little screws that attach the L bracket to this piece. Well, it's been a couple hours since I was putting together the first pieces, and I'm a small portion of the way through assembling this chest. And I came to the conclusion that for a $177 chest that has 72, I think, pieces to assemble, it's not worth the money because it's hard to read the instructions. Therefore, I'm going back and forth putting pieces together and using different brackets and screws to get the right one correct. And in the process of doing that, this, this particle board and stuff, is just it doesn't hold up to doing something a second time. I do have a couple other pieces assembled that I'd like to show you. I have this with the rails on one side and the other. And I have this piece with some more rails, as well as a second piece here with the rails on it. And on the other side you can see this little area where these little L brackets go in. I have the top piece and the bottom piece assembled. The next step is to put the walls of the chest together. Tighten this down. I'm going to start with the middle just to give it some sort of a base and support. That'll go on that side. Kind of get a feel of how wide the shelf will be when it goes in here. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Now I'll put the top piece on and tighten it down. A little bit of heavy material here. That's good. So now the top is secured. Just a matter of putting the back on and assembling the drawers. You have this piece here. You just hammer nails into these holes. And I have those in this little bag. Now I'm putting in the final few nails holding on the back. Welcome back to FM Review. This is day two of assembling this chest. So to assemble these shelves, You've got the side pieces, you've got these four holes, and you have these little plastic pieces that go into these holes. You line it up, you press it, and then push it in, and then you take your hammer and put them in. And you have to do this for 12, yes, 12 times. And the next piece is going to be these long ones here, so I'll see you in a few minutes. I have to put these rails on all 12 pieces like I've done before or like I have finished and the last one I have here I'll show you how it goes. You just line it up with these two pilot holes and these small screws hold the rail to the board. So basically you take one of these, one of these and you attach it to one of these. 
Well, I made it to the last one, and I'll show you real quick what I've done. You have these little small pieces that you screw into this hole. And you take these side panels, and you just attach it to the front of the drawer. Now, I found this easy, or I found this easier to use, a screwdriver with a magnetic bit. Just because my hand shakes and it falls out of place. So I place it in there, line it up, tighten it down. Two heavier are these small plastic pegs that goes into the top of this board here. And I, I'm really not confident with these, but you just stick them in this pre-drilled hole. Take your hammer, very gently you want to knock it in to the halfway mark where there's no threads on it. The next thing you have are these little small cam pieces that has a line indicating up or indicating the hole and you place it inside. And that's pretty much the steps involved in 16. And then you line it up with the holes that's pre-drilled. And to finish assembling the drawers, you take the back piece, place it into the grooves, and you have this top piece that has another groove and some pre-drilled holes. Take the screws, put them in the side, line them up with the pre-drilled holes, tighten them all down. Alright, now I have all these pieces assembled. The next step is putting the handles on the front. See there's two pre-drilled holes that line up with the holes in the back of the handle. And I ran the screw from the bottom, placed it in the hole, tightened it up a little bit, and I'll do the same on the other side. Now I'm finished with the assembly of the chest and it's put together. I will say that I'm glad this project is over and I really didn't enjoy putting it together. Three, two, one, action! Wow. I'm about to get a little bit aggravated with this. <laughs>